to monitor a server, one method is to install on this server a little piece of software, uh, which is called an agent or software agent. Well, both methods have been around for decades and uh, both have their own uh, advantages. Agent-based monitoring requires that you would install this little software agent on the equipment. Usually this is used for servers. The agent will collect locally all the metrics and will send them uh, to the monitoring platform. Uh, agentless solution uh, requires that the equipment has some kind of API or protocol for the monitoring platform to remotely collect the metrics. There is no need to install an agent beforehand. DevOps team uh, who develop and maintain their software applications use APM solutions, APM for application performance monitoring. And this solution usually uh, requires an agent, a software agent, to be embedded uh, with the application to collect all the traces, the logs, the metrics, so that they can be analyzed after that. And for DevOps team, it's not a problem to deploy this uh, agent on all, all the servers because they are in charge of deploying the software anyway. So adding the agent is both uh, easy and uh, very powerful. IT operations team uh, who are monitoring 100% of the infrastructure, not just servers, but uh, network, firewall, Wi-Fi, uh, SAN, databases, middleware, IoT, everything. They need a universal solution uh, that can work with all equipment without having to mess around uh, with the equipment. And in fact, they have no access to all these equipments anyway. So they will choose an agentless uh, monitoring solution. Centrion is an agentless uh, monitoring solution which uh, uses uh, all the APIs that are available or the standard uh, monitoring protocols such as SNMP or WS MAN in the Windows environment uh, to easily uh, connect to all equipment and monitor all kind of uh, diversity from the cloud and the legacy uh, and that makes it uh, very simple and straightforward uh, to use it. So this is for IT operations team monitoring 100% of the infrastructure.